गुड इवनिंग फ्रेंड्स दिस इज हेनरी फ्रॉम टेकलिम्स डॉट कॉम आई जस्ट लाइक टू गिव अ टूटोरियल ऑन हाउ टू क्रिएट टैब्स इन फेसबुक पेज यू कैन सी दिस इज द पेज ऑफ टेकलिम्स डॉट कॉम द फेसबुक पेज एंड आई लाइक टू हैव फ्यू टैब्स विच विल हेल्प माई फैंड्स टू क्लिक एंड सी वेरियस फीचर्स दैट आई हैव इन माई वेबसाइट एंड यू थिंक इट्स नॉट ईजी टू क्रिएट सच टैब्स and the facebook really has a very good application which will help you to create such beautiful tabs for example you must have seen google chrome fan page which will have many features like photos youtube apps quiz so i would like to give you a tutorial that will tell you how to create these tabs to create tabs in facebook page you need to install an application called static html iframe tabs you can find the application by typing it in the search bar click on the application and install it once the application has been installed you can find the new tab in the left side menu bar in my case i am creating my fifth tab so it shows welcome fifth welcome is the default name of the tag I'll tell you how to change the name of the tab later but before that whenever a fan clicks on this tab you need to display a content on the right side so in order to do that you need to add a content so click on the tab you will get a edit window which is displayed on the right side you can find a text box where you are going to input your html content this is the place where you can write any of the html code CSS or JavaScript. It all means that you need to have a few basic knowledge about how to create a web page. So I am just going to add an image which will be displayed when my fan clicks on the welcome tab. So I am just referring a welcome image from my website. When I am done, I am going to click the save button. So the HTML application. it gives you an option to view your tab as a non fan and as a fan let's view it as a non fan and this is what it shows so whenever user clicks on this tab i'm going to display a welcome message for example let's try to add one more tag which says that welcome to take glimpse fan page save it and you can view the change here welcome to the techlinks fan page note that whenever you want to edit the content of this particular tab just click on that and you will always have an edit window here where you can make the necessary changes now we have the content of the tab ready but we don't want the name really to be welcome for example let's name it as videos so in order to change the name of the tab it's not straightforward you just need to click the edit info when you have selected the tab so click edit info link you'll be taken on to the settings page you need to click the applications on the left side menu scroll down and try to find your application my case i am have installed it for the fifth time so it's so fifth tab click on the edit settings and name it as you want so i am naming it as videos okay now if you go to the fan page you will find the new tab named as videos now we almost have five tabs created the next point that we should decide is that if a fan visits my page which page or which tab should i show first so that is called landing tab so now we have to choose that one of the tab as the landing tab let's assume that i am going to choose teglims tv as my landing tab 
to do that we need to click on the edit info link so you will be taken on to the settings page in the settings page click on the manage permissions you will have various permissions for customizing your page options I want to choose my landing tab so you can find by default I have a welcome page to be shown as my landing tab let's assume that we want to have TechLimps TV as the landing page so click on that and save your options now if someone visits my fan page this is the URL of my TechLimps page the default landing page will be TechLimps TV so this is what the option which we have chosen as the landing tab so you can choose any of the tabs that you have already created this landing tab is particularly an important one you have to be careful in choosing the landing tab because the landing tab is going to be the first impression for any user or a fan who visits your page so you have to be careful in choosing the landing page we are done with our first tab but what happens if I want to create more number of tabs you can see that I have five tabs created here and if I want to add a sixth tab in your case it may be a second tab or third tab now I want to add a sixth tab you need to click on the FAQ page which comes with the application and move on to how do I add more than one tab so you can find the number of tabs which you want to add so when you click this you will be taken on to the sixth tab application so here you need to understand one thing that each particular tab is an application so if I want to have 10 tabs it means that I need to install 10 times of this particular application another important feature which I forgot to mention is that FBML mode apart from HTML CSS and JavaScript you can always have a piece of a code copied from Facebook API and put into this application as a content for your tab so that's the end of my tutorial hope it was use useful to you please be a fan of my page that's the only thing which I can ask you at the end of this tutorial thank you